I want to applaud President Obama in his wholehearted, heartfelt attempts to reform medical care in the United States. We have a great medical system, but unfortunately a lot of people, mainly those people who are over 18 and under 65, have a hard time accessing the medical care. We all pay for medical research through our taxes. It goes to the schools in the forms of grants and other things. We get great medical innovations, but a lot of people who are paying for the research and so forth don't get access to it because they just don't have the money and they don't or they don't have insurance that's good enough. I think we need to expand medical care to include not only seniors who now get uh, government sponsored medical care in the form of Medica Medicare, uh, Medicare, but also to children, some of whom get their medical care uh, from First Five and other groups um, or Social Security. Um, but we also need to go into the normal healthy adult who needs preventive care in order to stay healthy and get into old age in a healthy way. And people who have periodic illnesses who need surgery or some other um, health aid in order to continue working and being productive and to not get into a um, long-term chronic illness. We also need to make sure that um, all of the citizens, especially young people and people under 65, learn prevention and wellness so that they learn to keep their health and things they can do to maintain a healthy life and healthy lifestyle. So thank you President Obama, young healthy president who's trying to let us know that this is an opportunity for us to advance and let um, our medical care be used by more and more citizens, um, especially prevention and wellness. So I think it's a good idea. I hope you support it.